sword for the wall. I already have one. Good man. Have you swung it yet? Of course I have. At someone, I mean. It's a strange thing, the first time you cut a man. Realize we're nothing but sacks of meat and blood and some bone to keep it all standing. Let me thank you ahead of time, for guarding us all from the perils beyond the wall, wildlings and white walkers and whatnot. We're grateful to our good, strong men like you protecting us. We've guarded the kingdoms for 8,000 years. Is it we already? Have you taken your vows then? Soon enough. Give my regards to the Night's Watch. I'm sure it will be thrilling to serve in such an elite force. And if not, it's only for life. Septimal Dane says I have to do it again. My things weren't properly folded, she says. Who cares how they're folded? They're gonna get all messed up anyway. It's good you've got help. Watch. Nymeria, gloves. Huh? Mm -hmm. Impressive. Shut up. Nymeria, gloves. Mm. I have something for you. And it has to be packed very carefully. A present. Close the door. This is no toy. Be careful you don't cut yourself. You're so skinny. So are you. I had the blacksmith make it for you special. I won't hack a man's head off, but it can poke him full of holes if you're quick enough. I can be quick. You'll have to work at it every day. How's it feel? Do you like the balance? I think so. First lesson. Sticking with the pointy end. I know which end to use. I'm going to miss you. Careful. All the best swords have names, you know. Sansa can keep her sewing needles. I've got a needle of my own. Aya, open the door. May I come in? Whose sword is that? Mine. Give it to me. I know this maker's mark. This is Micken's work. Where did you get this? This is no toy. Little lady shouldn't play with swords. I wasn't playing. And I don't want to be a lady. Come here. And what do you want with this? Called Needle. Hmm. A blade with a name. And who were you hoping to skewer with Needle? Your sister? Do you know the first thing about sword fighting? 
Sticking with the pointy end. <laughs> That's the essence of it. I was trying to learn. I asked my kids to practice with me. I asked him. It was my fault. Oh, sweet girl, no, no. You didn't kill the butchers, boy. I hate them. I hate all of them. The Hound, the Queen and the King, and Joffrey and Sansa. Sansa was dragged before the King and Queen and asked to call the Prince a liar. So was I. He is a liar. Shh, darling, listen to me. Sansa will be married to Joffrey someday. She cannot betray him. She must take his side, even when he's wrong. But how can you let her marry someone like that? Look at me. You're a Stark of Winterfell. You know our words. Winter is coming. You were born in the long summer. You've never known anything else. But now winter is truly coming. And in the winter, we must protect ourselves. Look after one another. Sansa is your sister. I don't hate her. Not really. I don't want to frighten you, but I won't lie to you either. We've come to a dangerous place. We cannot fight a war amongst ourselves. All right? Go on. It's yours. I can keep it. Try not to stab your sister with it. If you want to own a sword, you better know how to use it. You stay out of this lot, boy. And stay. Or I'll lock you in the back of the wagon with these three. Watch yourself, midget. He's got a sword, this one. What's a gutter rat like you doing with a sword? Maybe he's a little squire. He ain't no squire. Look at him. He looks like a girl. I bet he stole that sword. Let's have a look. I could use me a sword like that. I would take it off him. Give it here, midget. Look at him. You better give up by the sword. I've seen him kick a boy to death. I knocked him down and I kicked him in the balls and I kept kicking him until he was dead. I kicked him all to pieces. You better give me that sword! You want it? I'll give it to you. I already killed one fat boy. I bet you never killed anyone. I bet you're a liar, but I'm not. I'm good at killing fat boys. I like killing fat boys. <laughs> oh, you like picking on the little ones, do you? You know, I've been hammering an anvil these past 10 years. When I hit that steel, it sings. You're gonna sing when I hit you. This is Castleford's steel. Where'd you steal it? It was a gift. <laughs> it don't matter now. Where we're going, they don't care what you've done. We've got rapers, pickpockets, highwaymen, murderers. Which are you? Armourer's apprentice. But my master got sick of me, so here I am. Come on, you sorry sons of whores! It's a thousand leagues from here to the wall! And winter is coming! Survivors. We'll take them back to Harren Hall. You heard him. You're coming with us. I yield! Help! Help me! It's 
Something wrong with your leg, boy. Look at it. Can you walk? No. You've got to carry me. All right. Carry him, he says. <laughs> <laughs> We're looking for a bastard named Gendry. Give him up. Or I'll start taking eyeballs. You want Gendry? <laughs> you already got him. I love that helmet. Something wrong with your leg, boy. What, what? What do you mean? Can you walk? I've got to carry you. Carry me? Fine little blade. Maybe I'll pick my teeth with it. <laughs> 